F-Point has the distinction of being named one of America's fastest growing companies for six consecutive years. Founded in 2001, the New Jersey-based company provides IT services to 14,000 clients worldwide to help them achieve cross-platform collaboration. Dr. TJ Jang is co-CEO and co-founder and spoke with us recently at his company's New Jersey headquarters. Hi, I'm TJ Jang, uh, co-CEO and co-founder of AppPoint. I do this work because it's actually creating something very different. We're actually creating meaningful work in the enterprise space to help enterprise collaborate better. Um, my previous job is actually on Wall Street. For me, I went back to graduate school uh, and did my uh, research degree in uh, data mining. And it's during that time we started this company. 9-11, um, my office, I was with Lehman Brothers at the time. My office 40th floor, North Tower. So everyone on my floor thankfully survived. Um, but that was an event that really taught us uh, how you know, unpredictable life could be, where we should really uh, try to do and maximize our potential. So uh, my other co-founder and co-CEO, Kai Gong, is the really uh, my very dear friend as well as close mentor, who's 12 years my senior. Uh, we, we became friends on my, since my first job out of college at Lucent Technology Bell Lab and uh, we have been running this company together for the last 15 years. Another uh, really great mentor uh, in my uh, research life is actually my, my advisor who's now the chairperson at uh, Stern Business School uh, for the uh, uh, Management Information Science Department and uh, Alexander Tuzlin. Uh, he's a, a consummate uh, learner, researcher, uh, always curious and always um, learning about new technologies. Uh, fortunately for me, work-life balance, work is life for me, uh, where that's what I'm passionate about. I have a very understanding family, so, uh, you know, uh, fortunately, uh, my, you know, my, my children are very young, so I can still spend much of my time uh, with uh, the much bigger AppPoint family. For 15 years, it's an eternity in software. Actually, even one year, it's a long time in software. I think there are some uh, f uh, statistics around Fortune 500 companies where uh, the Fortune 500 companies today, many of them didn't even exist 15 years ago. And there's also saying that 15 years from now, only maybe less than 10% of the Fortune 500 company are still around. So your question about 15 years from now, I would love it to be uh, a brand name within the enterprise, you know, as, as loud of a brand name as uh, Microsoft, as SAP. So we would love to become that level of brand recognition uh, in the space that we're in. I actually give uh, regular uh, lectures in uh, Stern Business School where I talk to executive MBAs and MBA students about taking risks. And life is uh, really too short and uh, we are very fortunate to be able to uh, do things that we uh, we can actually put our mind to, have the freedom uh, to actually pursue our, our passion and it's really to take risks. Many of the students uh, when they first graduate school graduate uh, from school they think that joining a big company, a brand name, a Fortune 500, it's a safe route. Well, safe route is not what gets you uh, to actually uh, a very happy uh, endeavor in a happy future. I took the risk and go to become a full-time graduate student making going from a Wall Street salary to no salary. So that's the type of risks I encourage people to take to pursue their passion uh, to not be happy with the status quo. Uh, but fear is a natural part of everything. I think for us entrepreneurs, we're always living uh, in the fear of um, you know things not working out but also what drive us really really from a day-to-day -day basis is that fear of failure I think leveraging fear in a positive way it's a very good way to actually grow yourself I would really like to thank my parents actually on, on recently a dear friend of mine whose uh, mother passed away and we were talking about the same situation where as uh, sons of immigrant parents we were able to uh, thanks to our parents to come to America uh, to really realize our American dream where we have the f fortunate opportunity to actually get a great education and be able to pursue what we love to do. And not many people are that fortunate uh, in parts of the world where uh, it is almost impossible to break through that uh, social barrier, that uh, different type of opportunity limitations. Uh, I, for that, we, we, I, I would love to you know, thank my parents for giving me the opportunity.
啊、呃，现在是我们应该是啊、呃、一个感恩的时呃时期，所以祝大家新年快乐啊、呃，恭喜发财啊！呀、呃。Yeah. <笑>